helicopters flew over paratroopers and Iraqi scouts at Al-Assad Air Base. After firing at targets, Iraqi scouts called in. But before missions or exercises like this occur, there's training. Staff Sergeant Giovanni on 3rd of 319th uh, Battalion FSNCO. Uh, today we're conducting, well for the next three days we'll be conducting some training um, for the IA, uh, teaching them a little bit of a AGI. AGI, or Air Ground Integration Training, consists of land navigation, and you slide it across, you take and you put that X, marking techniques, and five line procedures for directing and employing rotary wing close air support. The Iraqi scouts also had hands-on familiarization with the Kiowa helicopters, allowing them to better understand the assets they would request close air support from during the live fire portion of the AGI training. As the 50 caliber machine gun marked the target, Iraqi scouts applied the training they received by calling in a close combat attack to the Kiowa helicopter crew with assistance from their U.S. mentors. The U.S. forces are training us on all the air support methods. They have done a very good job on teaching and training us on this. As the light in the sky faded, the Iraqi scouts' knowledge of air ground integration grew with each pass of attacking helicopters. Army Private First Class Jessica Cook, Al-Assad, Iraq.